um, got brought home today, mate. Thoughts? Mate, just in the team. Dean's obviously on the bench, which is a good thing. Obviously, I don't like the stick that he's always getting, because under Remy, he was immense. And under Monk as well. Yeah. Sometimes players just don't fit into the system of the manager. But seeing Dean as captain, obviously, every time he's been captain, we've played well, and hopefully another win today. Yeah. Um, team lineup. good to have uh, Pedersen and Graham back. Yeah, Tuesday at Carlos with, with the young lads playing, it was kind of... It was it. I'm not going to say there was out of the depth, but still learning. But it's nice to have a bit of experience back and help us get three points. Yeah, definitely. What Do you make a Blackpool this season? You've seen them much? Or? Mate, their manager, absolutely brilliant. I think they've just given him like another five-year contract, which is well-deserved, because he'll be snapped up by the Premier League team soon. Brilliant team, they've got some good results, especially against Fulham as well, so it's going to be a tough game. Yeah, their away form's really good this season, from yeah, what so I've seen. I'm saying 1-0. One 1-0. Nil. One nil. Goal scorer? Mate, everybody that watches knows I'm going to say Dean, he'll take the scores again. <laughs> keep right on. He's due a goal, isn't he? Mate, yeah. he is. Up the blues, mate. Up the blues, keep right on. Keep right on. Jamie, how you doing, mate? Uh, yeah, I'm alright, thank you. How are you? Oh, I'm not too bad. Yeah, good lad. Back to, you're back today, you weren't at Coventry away. No. You're back. Yeah. Back, back at Blues at home, so. Blackpool at <coughs> home. What, what are your thoughts? Um, well, now I've seen the lineup, like, I'm a little bit more confident than I was this morning, because I was thinking this morning, like, I can see Blackpool do, doing us over, like, because obviously we're missing so many players, but obviously now I've seen the lineup. Because we got Christian Pedersen back and Jordan Graham, which is going to be a massive help. Very positive, so, isn't it? Yeah. So I think today I'm going. I think it will be a, still a very difficult game. It's just, but I'm more confident than I was. So I'm going to go with three-one uh, Blues today. Goal scorers. Uh, I'm going to go Troy Deeney with one of them. Uh, Scott Hogan and I'm going to go Riley McGree and all. Riley McGree. So, Dean needs to do a goal, isn't he? Yeah, like 100% like, like he has had his moments now and again, it's just, just hasn't got in for him or like he just hasn't been getting the service because obviously as I said like we're just missing so many players so. Yeah, definitely mate. Well, we ain't winning three games, so let's hope we can get three points today. Yeah, fingers crossed, eh? Up the blues, mate. Up the blues. Come on, you blue boys! Keep right on, mate. Keep right on. Yes, Scott Lewis, I'm at the stadium now. Team lineup is out. Pedersen and Graham are back from injury. So they, they come into the starting 11. So yeah, Jordan James in centre mid with Sunjik. So that is great to see Jordan James play. He's played really well since he's come into the team recently on the bench and stuff when he's come on at Hull and other games as well. So yeah, great to see it. So we've got in goal with Sarkic, centre backs. Roberts, Sanderson and Pedersen. So Pedersen replaces Harley Dean. Left wing back Bella, right wing back Graham. Centre mid, Sunjik and Jordan James. Cam, Riley McGree, up front, Hogan and Troy Dini. So, get into the ground now guys and come on the Blues!
Liverpool trying to get under the court but lose defending well. No clear cut chances for either team really. Yeah. That's like really nothing to report at the moment. Come on the boys. Well, Liverpool have got some good players Good chance, as you can just see there, guys, from Blackpool. Blue's not really creating anything still. No creativity in the final third from us. Blackpool, definitely the better team out of two teams so far. So we really need to step this up. Otherwise, in the second half, exactly like Reading at home, Blackpool will cause us real problems. So we need to step it up. So come on. Yes guys, it is half time. Birmingham City nil, Blackpool nil. Like I just said, uh, as you saw me around the 38th minute, I think it was, we literally have done absolutely nothing in this game. It's been dreadful from our point of view. Blackpool really starting to come into the game now. Their creativity is really starting to show. They haven't had many clear-cut chances, but they are slightly creeping to getting clear-cut chances. So we really need to sharpen up in the second half. Otherwise, like at Reading, like at Hull, Obviously Reading were at home, but we were away. We'll just get punished. We'll get absolutely punished. And they've got really good players on the bench today, Blackpool. Shane Lavery and Jerry Yates, two really good strikers. I'm shocked they haven't even gotten but these one of them will probably Gary Medine to take the game to us. But I'm telling you now, if they bring both of them to on, or even just one of them, they will cause us real problems. Blues, we need to make some changes at half time, or we need to do something. Boya needs to kick their asses up at half time honestly I'm not really impressed with the performance so far from us absolutely no creativity at all really we've had like I think we had a chance in the first minute up from Jeremy Bella which just hit the side netting that's been our best chance so far and we've had one or two others but nothing other than that Bella chance really so yeah at half time guys it is Birmingham City nil that ball nil but yeah we need to really pick this up in the second half of a while as Blackpool will pick us off so yeah we'll get on to the second half now guys so see you in a bit guys
we've really come into this game now. Blackpool sighted up the second half all right, but it's all blues at the moment. The green sights cause Blackpool some problems. This is much, much better than blues. So yeah, come on the blues, let's get a goal. Come on! What's the save there from the Tisha Sarkis guys? That ball on the corner now. Great save from the Tisha Sarkis. Let's see what we do from this corner. Right, yeah, great save from the Tisha Sarkis. Interesting game at the moment. We're still playing alright, but that ball is still looking a little bit dangerous. So. We need to get momentum, keep the momentum up, push them, push them. Now, Troy Dean is coming up, everybody. And coming on is Lucas Jukovic. Yeah, that's right, boys. Troy Dean is off, and Lucas Jukovic is on. Good decision from Lee Bowyer. Yeah. And earlier, he also brought Chucks and EK on. Then he brought Jeremy Beller off. Yeah. Now we have Jukovic over and an EK on front. Come on, the move. Lucas Djukovic but, and the Blackpool players are saying it was offside. One of the players has been booked. The ref was going over to Lisbon to have a look. But it's 1-0 Blues. Goal stands. 1-0 Blues. Lucas Djukovic. Come on, let's see this out and get three points. Come on, the Blues. Guys, that's right, only four minutes to the stoppage time. Blues was still one up against Blackpool. Can we hold out for the win? And a massive three points this will be, considering the facts, like I've said, we haven't won in three games. It'll be a massive three points. Yeah, let's hold out now and come on, Blues.